Art is the medium to express one's thoughts and feelings. Once a part of tribal beauty, body art is now practiced all over the world. This amazing art was found in Egypt and the word tattoo came from a Tahitian word tatao which means to mark. Designs on the arms, shoulders and chest are common among men while women also get them done on their feet and exposed parts of stomach. It's become a trend and this art is gaining popularity among the young blood who find it a vibrant medium of expressing themselves to the world. I have a tattoo on my back and that's um, it is actually a Chinese uh, word two letters which stands for angel. It's a very very neat way of expressing yourself and it's so colorful and it's like it's like an art you know and I, I always like actually I thought it's going to be really painful and people always keep saying that you know it's really painful but Actually, it's not all that, you know, you can really take it. It's almost like an ant bite. And first time when I saw the needle, I was scared. I was actually scared. But then when it actually started, the color started a growing like thing, you know. And it was really neat and I, it was worth all the pain. Uh, they generally t uh, trace the design and then they use a gum base and they p apply it on our uh, skin, wherever, whichever position, wherever you want that. And after that, they uh, they use the machine. Tattooing is kind of fun. It's a good way of uh, removing out your emotions, like say pent up emotions, actually. But it's more of body art for me. It's more into the rock scene. It's kind of passionate, actually. I'm kind of passionate about body art. Talking about that is like whatever you feel inside or whatever anger or anything, you're tattooing the pain through it. It's kind of fun. I know people find it crazy, but you know it's kind of fun. Uh, if it's bad for health, it's upon the person. If he can't feed himself properly, it's bad for him. Everything is bad for health. You do anything, excess is bad. But for me, I find tattooing good. I, I like it. It's a sense of body art. So for me, yeah, I would say like go ahead and have fun. Try it out. But don't try a big one. Try a small one first. If you like it, then go on for a big one. But think before doing something. Although the process of tattooing is somewhat painful and even bloody, tattoo lovers don't complain. No pain, no gain, they say in the pursuit of fashion and beauty. But when it comes to young, hip-hop and trendy, tattoos, fingernail painting and even body piercing, join the band of body art, sought after for rebellious expressions. In Mangalore, we don't have this trend of guys putting nail polish, but abroad it's kind of common, so I don't find it a problem. I don't know, people might find me a female or something all of a sudden, but no, it's kind of fun, it's kind of trendy. It's the next thing. Actually fun, look at your own fingers when you play the speed actually on the frets. It's kind of fun when you like go like this, your fingers move quite fast. And it's nice to see your fingers, it kind of gives it. Body art symbolizes beauty and glamour and is now turning into a fashionable art form. But for many, body art crafted with glowing colours is one easy way found to enhance human beauty and personality levels. All said and done, body art is taking deep roots in the fast growing city of Mangalore. With cameraman Austin for TV Daiji World, this is Gloria signing off.